Tonight on Behind the Music, we take a look at the long-lost legacy of artist Four Piece. What happened to him? What happened to him and his Twitter beef? What happened to his beef with Softy Poo? This and many other questions are going to be answered tonight on Behind the Music. Almost like an episode of Catfish, Four Piece came and went. It was like he just vanished in the thin air. In 2014, there was beef between rapper Softy Poo and rapper Four Piece. Softy Poo posted the six second Instagram video of him throwing dirt on chicken nuggets. He also posted on Instagram a picture of him wearing Four Piece's chain. When we had the interview chance with rapper Four Piece, we talked to him about the incident with the chain. This was his response. Okay, so I was walking right, and dude gonna look at me. He said, hey, yo. And I was like, what up, dope? And then he was like, burr, 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 burr. and I turned around, right? Dude stole my chain, right? But like, he didn't really take the chain, but he thought he took it. So then I came up and I punched him, gave a good two piece, right? They call me four piece for a reason, but I didn't want to do all that, you know what I mean? Because I'm not, th I'm not that type of dude. Like I do what I do, but I don't do what I do because I want you to know that I don't do what I do, you know what I mean? So yeah, he got my chain, but I got it back though. Unfortunately at the time, public relations officer Kevin Kahlo was unable to comment on Four Piece's interview. Following certain controversy, Four Piece also went on to talk about his music career. What inspires you to make music? A lot of things, you know what I mean? I mean, when I was little, I always wanted to go to college, and I went to college for like a week, and then I figured out I didn't want to go to college because, you know, it's kind of hard, and I got to study and stuff. So I was like, you know what I'm going to do? I can't, I can't play basketball, so I was like, I'm going to be a rapper, you know what I mean? So I do what I do because I be seeing people around me, and I be trying to, like, put what they do like in the words and that's what I do, you know what I mean? And like I'm I'm from the hood and like they can't talk like I talk, you know what I mean? So I gotta do what I do, man. For ten years, man. That's what I be feeling like hip hop. Like I be seeing this dude, he like diarrhea and this dude is like chunks and then like this dude is like a stream of duty. Like it's just not cool, man. And like these kids out here they really believe in this dude. Like I made a song two years ago called Poo Poo and Yo Doo Doo, right? And then some other dudes gonna make a song called Wee Wee and Yo Pee Pee. And like, bro, that's not original. I do this, man. That's what I do. I'm the original out here and they trying to copy me. I'm four piece, he eight piece, he twelve piece, he twenty piece. Bro, I just want some chicken nuggets, man. There's a, you need to like, there's a difference between me and them, you know what I mean? I'm from the streets, from the hood. When your homies get shot in the face, you go and talk to them, you know what I mean? Like, make sure they cool. So, I'm coming out of White Castles, and like, dude, he looked over, he said, bro, look over here, my homie look, got shot. All right, I'm looking at him, right? Dude gonna come around me, stab me in my ankle real quick, and then take my chain. Bro, what type of G stuff is that? You know what I mean? I wasn't even looking at him, bro. But he 12, I'ma let it slide, you know what I mean? But I got my chain back. I got my chain back, bro. What's this, bro? What's this? What is it? It's a chain. Thank you, bro. See where it says four piece? I do. <sighs> I'm checking my Twitter right now, bro. I'm real important, you know. You know, bro, bro. I'm real important. I'm checking Softy Poo, Softy Poo's Twitter right now. Can't even say his name. You know what I mean? Like he not, he not irrelevant. You know what I mean? Yeah. He ain't got no followers, bro. Want to know why? Cause people care about me. When I'm eating cereal in the morning, people care about me. Okay. When I'm eating my fruit roll-ups and my packages of ramen noodle soup, people care about me, bro. Nobody care about him. Nobody probably even seen a picture on his Instagram cause he ain't got no followers, bro. Doctor Phil follow me, bro. Yeah, I've been going through some hard times. He be trying to help me, you know what I mean? So, like, if you ask me what I got to say to that, I ain't got to say nothing to it. You know what I mean? I'm talking right now about it, but I don't mean nothing. This whole interview don't mean nothing, okay? <laughs> My parents got divorced. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> you know, thugs cry. Tupac. R.I.P. Okay. Unfortunately, that's where his legacy ends. And that's pretty much where the book ends. Nobody knows what happened to him. And to be honest, nobody really cares. 
but thanks for tuning in tonight on Behind the Music.